Once you've hit a couple of kills, you may want to incorporate the pin shot or the corner shot. This shot is particularly effective if you find that your opponent is off center or is not playing a good center court position. The pin shot goes into the side wall, close to the front wall, but caroms off at an angle that becomes a little bit different or difficult for your, for your opponent to anticipate. You want to hit this ball with as much force as you're hitting a kill. The pin shot also, depending on your position on the court, may pick up enough natural spin that may create a splatting or a skirting effect. This is, a, this is the benefit of a pinch that sometimes is called a splat shot, which is a real favorite amongst the pros. Again, in order to hit this shot effectively, you have to get down on the ball. You do not want to try to hit a pinch shot standing up or from higher levels from waist and shoulder high because then it becomes a real easy setup for your opponent. You want to maintain the same consistency or the same height an approach of killing a uh, pin shot as you would a kill shot. So remember, you want to get down, making contact around lead, knee level, and hitting a pin shot. Now in review. A pin shot is an excellent shot to mix up in hitting a winner, especially if your opponent is off to one side of the court and is not maintaining good center court control.